Thank you for this food you prayed to bless it. Please help it to bring healing and nourishing to Grace's body. Thank you for providing. Continue watching us and keep us. And continue to heal her. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Good morning, you guys. Um, today is day one after her admission in hospital. This is the first day at home. I am now feeding Gracie some cereal. Yesterday when we came home, Gracie was coughing more than when she was in hospital. I we mean, we live really high. I don't know if it's because it's a bit cooler up here. Although we closed the windows and door and, and somewhere, she was still coughing a lot. So I dressed her warm and I went to bed early with Gracie because she wasn't feeling so great. We went to bed early and last night Gracie slept for a few hours. She didn't sleep for long. Y'all, I was so tired, so, so tired. I spent three nights in hospital, not talking about the nights before. Um, whenever Gracie is sick, I always stay up the two nights before. Plus, I spent three nights in hospital with Gracie. Gracie was sleeping on my chest for those three nights. Um, I didn't get much sleep. I hardly get any sleep. And last night, Gracie was not feeling so great. I said I would take Gracie in. And Gracie fell asleep. I fell asleep. But it is always when Gracie is sick, it's always when she's the, I'm sleeping, she decides the most. During the day, she'll be there, she'll be fine. But when she's sleeping, she will decide. So Gracie slept for a few hours, not because she was deciding. She slept for a few hours. And then Gracie decided she's going to party for the rest of the night until the morning. I was so, so tired. So Paul stayed up for a good while. And then I woke up still feeling tired, still feeling sleepy. But I woke up and I took care of Grace and Paul went back to sleep because Paul had to go to work today. Um, here with Gracie, this morning Gracie fell asleep again and the same thing. And the same thing was happening at the hospital as well. Because um, I remember one night the nurse came and she told me fix Gracie because if Gracie continues to desat, she had put her on the bed for a little while and she told me, if Gracie continues to decide, she'll have to put the oxygen back for Grace. So I took Gracie and I put her back on my chest and Gracie slept the, for the rest of the night. No problem, no decides. So this morning I put her in the bed and she was decides. I really wanted Gracie to sleep in the bed so I could get some rest, but she was still decides and I had to take Gracie again and put Gracie on my chest to sleep. Yesterday, whilst we were in the hospital, I started feeling like my chest was hurting me, but she was deciding and I put her back on my chest and she slept well. She was still deciding a bit, even on my chest, because I don't have a hospital bed to prop me up the way I was. I just had to take some pillows and prop myself up. So that's what's happening. Um, she sounds so much more congested at home than when she was in the hospital. Um, her nose was burning a lot yesterday when we came home. I haven't seen any of that runny nose today. Gracie is still very sick. Um, she's just well enough to go home. This morning, I called my husband and I told him about the desserts. And I'm like, I don't even know if we should take her back. Let's watch and see. Let's see how it's going to go. If Gracie, if I find that, if we see that Gracie is still deserting, I will have to take Gracie back to the hospital. Don't put your head in the phone, mama. I would prefer to take Gracie to the hospital for nothing uh, than to stay home and stay home and she is not feeling so good. But honestly, I, 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 she's starting at 98, so I don't see anything saying that I have to take her, so she is really good. Um, a while ago when I put her in the chair, you heard the noise, is because I had um, disconnected her from the monitor and I did reconnect her to the monitor. That's why it was alarming. This is what's going on right now. I am still giving her puffer every four hours. 
um, she is still eating very well um, so today I will not be able to do anything today I am home alone yesterday afternoon when we came home Paul took her to the bathroom gave her a bath I went straight to the kitchen just dropped my stuff at the front door went straight to the kitchen I prepared some food I honestly didn't have I didn't have the strength to record what was going on I was way too tired so I just cooked some green bananas I cooked some basmati rice and I made a curry chicken I that's what we had for dinner um, I gave Gracie some cereal for dinner and we went to bed early really early after seven we went to bed she doesn't have a fever her fever went since Saturday she she doesn't have a fever good girl good cough mama and yeah so far she's looking great excuse her hair excuse me myself the monitor is beeping because gracie is kicking her legs and it's not picking up sensor is off yeah. why is it saying sensor is off mommy it looks fine Okay, I'm gonna take it out and I'm gonna take it. Ooh, careful. Do I need a new probe? Give me that toe. Give, give me the toe. I need your toe. Okay? Wait, Gracie, girl. Wait. Okay, there. Hello. How are you today, Mama? How are you doing, my baby girl? How are you doing? Good? Oops, 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 oops. We're sharing germs? That's okay. How are you, Gracie girl? How are you today? How are you today? 